All right. Magic wonder here on the Rapatillo Entertainment System. Are we streaming? Stream starting soon. The stream might start soon. Fingers crossed. I feel like my heart's in the right place. Start that stream. And yeah, I mean, we're dealing with post holidays. Post holiday blues. What are you going to do when the post holiday blues come after you? Easter was great. Easter was awesome. I loved Easter. But Easter's over, man. Easter's fucking over. I made this beautiful Easter room for what? For one day. We can only stay in the Easter room for one day. It's sad. But we're going to have some fun today. We're going to do some Street Fighter. Very, very dramatic scene from Bloodsport. Jean-Claude Van Damme is blinded. And he has to go by the Holy Spirit to fight this dude. Bright light. I've mimed this scene so much. I love this scene. Just clear your mind. Go back to your your special place with Jean Claude. And you can kick ass. Clear that mind. God bless him. All right, let's get our mind uncleared. Let's play some damn games. Gonna have to do it up on the Street Fighter. That's the only way to cure the post-holiday blues is we're going to have to get into a couple of brawls. That's what I'm talking about. We got very close last time to the end of the game. There was an air of excitement. I think we can do this shit. Usually you play Street Fighter with six buttons, but I only have a three button Sega Genesis controller. So we're just gonna slightly lower the difficulty and lock and load. All right, let's do this. Chun-Li. <gasps> All right, right off the bat, right off the bat. Fighting ourselves, which we have to do in life. We're going to have to look ourselves in the mirror sometimes, and we're not going to like what we see, and we're going to have to fight. Oh, shit. She's better than me. I only have the three buttons instead of the six, so I can't do the punches unless I press start and go to punches. I don't need the punches. I just need to get her in the corner and kick, 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 kick it. Kick ass. Wow. Just like Jean-Claude Van Damme, clearing our minds. All right, got to get back, get back. Oh my God, she almost got a cheap shot on me. All right, get that music back up. Oh, there's no pause on this game. Very sad, very sad. Can't pause the game, right into the shit. Where are we? Where the heck are we? What is that guy doing to that chicken in the background? It's like a mugging. He's got one hand on his chicken feet and the other hand's like feeling his, his beak and holding them down covering his chicken cries so he doesn't interrupt this amazing fight that's happening right now in the streets of China. (sighs) 
That's what I'm talking about. That's the only way to deal with post-holiday sadness. Easter can be hell. It can be hell on earth. I've had some horrible, horrible fucking Easters, God. Oof. Dad wants to put in the passion of the Christ. Vietnam vet. Alcohol got to him. And he wants to sit down on Easter. And he wants to watch that passion of the Christ with my grandmother. Jesus, this guy looks like my dad too. This is so fucked up right now. I'm dealing with a lot of skeletons right now. I'm fighting my dad. All right, lock and load. Son of a bitch. Yeah, my dad had the same sort of handlebar mustache, Vietnam vet, and real shit show. And I just kicked his ass. That was perfect. I got triggered. We don't have to worry about him ever again. Didn't have to see him yesterday on Easter. He was in Massachusetts. God, I wish they kept that map up. He was in Massachusetts. And I was in California, Southern California. But right now we are in India. Fighting for our lives. God, why do they have to bring that poster in the background of Ganesh? See that elephant god sitting on the rug back there? That's the god of wisdom, remover of obstacles. And they got him right in the middle of this. It's an ugly scene. We are really kicking ass right now, considering that I can only use three buttons instead of the regulation six, which you're required on the Street Fighter, but still kicking ass. Man. You just gotta clear your mind. Jean-Claude Van Damme, one of his finest acting roles. Bloodsport, blinded by the salt, cannot see anything, has to rely on instincts. Okay, we'll get back to that, we'll get back to that, yeah. Oh, bonus round, bonus round, we gotta start kicking. Jeez, I wanna show you Jean-Claude Van Damme and Bloodsport, and we're losing precious dollars on this bonus round right now. Get to the other side. It's gonna be close. Can we destroy this car? Ah! If I didn't show you Jean Claude Van Damme, we would have done it. It's beautiful, though. Jesus, they're not giving us any easy ones early. We're going after Ryu. Holy shit, he is coming right out of the box. Throwing punches. I hope you guys had a good Easter. I hope you got eggs. And if you don't like eating eggs, I hope they were as far a fuck away from you as possible. Jeez. Plowing through the competition. I mean... If you have a rough holiday and the relatives are judging you, having like a Senate committee at, at, the, at the dinner table, they're set up like a Senate committee grilling you about your life. Why are you living in a band jam space? Why are you homeless? It gets ugly. And sometimes fictionally kicking the shit out of people on video games is the only way to deal with post-holiday depression. Whew. That felt good. He doesn't even really seem like a fighter. He's hanging out at a jacuzzi in his underwear. Our lady, though, she looks amazing. All right, lock and load.
Boom. That's perfect. Look at that. That was for this cat. I love this cat. Multicolored, sexual, beautiful cat. Outdoors. Let's get back to this. You are the strongest woman in the world. I like that little pose she does at the end. Jesus. Brazil. Blanca. This isn't going to be... It's not going to be easy. They're throwing everybody at us. This guy can electrocute himself, but we're not going to give him the chance. Kicking ass. Oh, wait a minute. There's two rounds. All right. Lock into this, Robert. Look at the size of that fish in the background. What is that, like a carp? Doesn't matter. We are demolishing the competition. This is the only way I can deal with not getting that stimulus check. The side effects of that vaccine. All right, bonus stage. Lock and load. No, not with the elbow kick. I only have three buttons. Usually on this game you have six, so you can punch and kick. But in order for us to punch, we have to press start to switch the punch and then back to kick. It is a severe pain in the ass, but doesn't matter. Looks like we're still got it. Gosh. I don't feel as depressed about Easter anymore. I feel empowered now. I feel like anything is possible tonight. What? I don't, I, what the hell just happened? I don't want to go to that screen. I'm sorry. All right. Gil. What's his name? Jill. Anyways, we're going to beat the shit out of him in front of his army buddies. <sighs> nice. We are clearing up the whole world of these shitty bastards. Already on Battle 7, we're speed rounding this fucking game. Like champs. Oh, dirty move into that box. Kicking ass. Jean-Claude would be proud. Lock right back into it. Oh, Jesus. We're going into the finals. This is the last guy on the... Before the playoffs. Ken. Fighting at a... Dirty wharf in front of immigrants. Look at those people in the background in the trench coat. Right off the boat, and they have to watch this bloody battle on the wharf. Two warriors. She's amazing. And right into round two. I love doing this for people just coming over on that boat to this country in the background. They're the real heroes. Oh god, this game is getting tougher and tougher. Son of a bitch, chun -Li. We did it! Hell yeah! You sure are. Now it's on to the semifinals. Oh shit. In Vegas, too. A lot of shitty bastards in the background that are Bitcoin millionaires, won't wear condoms during sex. 
don't like any of Tori Amos' albums. But we're going to kick this guy's ass and get the hell out of Vegas, just like that. That was close. Putting us up against a fucking Mike Tyson ripoff. I don't know how I feel about that. But I do like winning. Alright. Ooh, shit. I felt that. I felt that from here. Son of a bitch. They are not screwing around. Oh, he is jacked. Look at those arms. Gosh. All right. Locked and loaded. Avoid that uppercut. Jesus, that comes out of left field. Nice. I just lost a lot of people money in Vegas back there. Look at those sons of bitches crying. They actually are. All right. We're going to Spain. Oh, bonus stage. Barrels. 80% of bonus stages in the 80s were barrels. You had to fight barrels. Barrels were like murdering your family. They should have just made a whole game where barrels took over a city, holding everybody hostage. I think we're going to have a perfect game. Boom. We got every one of those fucking battles. Barrels. In the battle. All right. On to Spain. <sighs> Vega. Guy gets to use a fucking Swiss Army knife on his arm. Look at that. That's not fair. He gets to climb the cage. He gets to do everything. This is not sanctioned. This is probably put on by Don King or some shit. But we still win. Even though he's got a Wolverine claw in his fucking arm. And all I know how to do is kick, man. We only got three buttons. I ain't paying the extra $40 on Amazon to get a six-button controller. I haven't got my stimulus. I ain't wasting good money on that right now. Ugh. Two warriors. One of them only able to kick. That's me. <sighs> Come on, you son of a bitch. That was beautiful. <sighs> Even though we were handicapped just like Jean-Claude Van Damme, we still kicked ass. All right. All right. This is it. This is the semifinals. Thailand. This guy is tough as shit. I don't care. Post-Easter, I've had sushi. I got some weed in me. I fed the cat. I think we can just plow through this. Ooh. Forgot about that uppercut. Okay, going back, going forward. <sighs> just kicking ass. All right. One more. What a shitty dude. He's lost his eye. He's living in Thailand. He insists that we fight in front of a Buddha statue. And just like that. Where's my belt? All right, this is it. This is the finals. Ooh. This guy's tough as fuck. I think played by Raul Julia in the movie, who died. Just like this guy just died. Hell of a fight. We're gonna beat this game. It's the only way to handle Easter. You guys remember Easter? That was yesterday? Yeah. All right. One more fight. 
If we beat Street Fighter on a Monday night, man, that ain't bad. That's something. I might be unemployed. Hate myself when I look in the mirror in the morning, but if I kick the shit out of this freak, it's gotta mean something. Oh, look at that move. We gotta avoid that move. Perfect. We didn't lose one battle. We did it together. We're champions. Champions for once in our miserable lives. Look at us. Ah, congratulations. Let's see our epic ending. Wait a minute, what? Why don't you try the harder difficulty level? Okay, I, I played it on easy. That's fine. That's it? You're not going to give me a... An ending just because I cheated and played it on easy? Ugh. Okay. That's fine. We still beat the game. Even if it was easy. We'll try it on medium next time. Whew. I thought that was still tough. Alright. We gotta clear our mind. We're going underwater. With Echo. The Dirty Festival Dolphin. If you've had a bad day at work, if you've had a miserable holiday, this dolphin's gonna make it all okay. Cause he's in a lot worse shape than you. Piece of shit lives underwater with his dirty, hippie, liberal dolphin friends. Snorting dolphin Adderall. Fucking each other each up their dolphin bums in the ocean floor. It's a nasty scene right now. Okay. The marks on your head look like stars in the sky. I, uh, what does that mean? You can talk to these creatures, but do you really want to? Okay, it's not about talking to these dolphins. It's about getting over an awful holiday. Was it good for you? Were your relatives mean to you on Easter? Was the government mean to you on Easter? Well, we're underwater now. Shut off your Facebook. Stop looking at your ex-girlfriend's profile. And join us underwater on Echo the Dolphin. A lot of us don't get through life in one piece, we know that. We know a lot of us are, are up shit creek without a paddle. But at least in video games, we can be anything. We can be dolphins. We don't have to be 44 with kidney disease hating the person we see in the mirror, we can be dolphins. I gotta get over this hill or I'm not gonna be a dolphin for long. All right, come on, you son of a bitch. Yes! Kicking ass at this game. All right, I guess they want us to go deep underwater. We'll do that together. I have no idea what this dolphin wants me to do for her. Doesn't seem to be any bad guys. Everybody seems to be happy on this game. Look at this. It's like one of those underwater pools that rich people have in Thailand. They get people to dig for them. This dolphin has it made. We can just jump over this for a few hours and forget about all the pains in our life. Well, what pains are coming up? If we have doctor's appointments? If we have to confront bullies on the train? <laughs> Two Cute Brothers says that dolphin doesn't look too happy. Well, that dolphin had a real shitty Easter. So that dolphin, you remember Easter, right? You know, I mean, I made this whole room for Easter. Look at that. 
We had a great time yesterday on Easter. I should cover her up. It was a beautiful time. And now it's Monday. We gotta hit the wall. We gotta we gotta hit that wall hard, and we gotta go through that wall together. And it's a lot easier in the video game world to go through that wall, especially if you're a dolphin. Like watch, watch how great this dolphin goes through the wall. Ow. Okay, he doesn't go through the wall too well. Ah, oh, thank you, two cute brothers. You watched the Easter episode, which is on the Twitch. You should watch it. I was in an incredible mood. I bought myself sushi. I had a great phone call with my dad. It was beautiful. I miss you. When are you coming back to Massachusetts? I don't know, Dad. I still gotta get the vet. Hey, I gotta talk to that whale. Son of a bitch. Ugh. We needed that whale, man. That whale was supposed to... Do something. Oh, there he is. There he is. Hey. What's up, dude? How was your Easter? Oh, I gotta move my stupid picture for a second. I know not what happened to your pod. What the hell does that even mean? Perhaps the big blue will help you. You must travel the undercaves to find him. All right. <laughs> Okay, I hope you guys are having a wonderful night here. I, I gotta put myself up in the corner. I can't see this goddamn fish. All right. Echo the dirty fish. What are you gonna do for us? You gonna get caught in some Coca-Cola wrap? Those plastic wraps they put on the Coca-Cola, the liners, whatever they're called. You gonna get your neck caught on it? Drown? Oh, that was pretty sweet. I wish they gave you points for doing dolphin tricks. It's not like Tony Hawk's skating, that's for sure. <laughs> you can't... <laughs> I can do some pretty sweet moves with this dolphin. Watch this. 360, right there. But they don't give you any points. I'll do that again. This is fun, man. Get those jellyfish... <laughs> Alright, one more time. Get those goddamn jellyfish out of my fucking way. Here we go. Sick! I wish you guys could try this. This is... This is not helping us win the game, but... God, when you've had a shitty Easter, this is the best. Alright, wh where else can we go? Is this dolphin gonna even do anything for us? Or is he just gonna hide in this underwater cave? I gotta watch some video on this. I have no idea what to do with this mis miserable fish right now. He's just... He's a mess. Alright. I'm about to tap out on this fish. You've had your day, Echo. This is the room you die in. I'm sorry. I have a lot of fun with that fish sometimes, and then... I don't. But I'll tell you what I have a lot of fun doing. Especially after Easter. As ghouls and fucking ghosts. This is a classic. To me, it's my favorite game, obviously, on the Sega Genesis. There's nothing better than killing all these goddamn monsters. And they are monsters, I'm not just saying it figuratively. They're monsters. What they've done to my wife, unforgivable. I'm gonna move my logo up so I can see those goddamn monsters. We don't need to know the time. I'm hiding the time, see? The time is behind my graphic. I took all the clocks off the wall because there's no help for these fucking monsters. I'm in a bad mood after the holidays and these assholes are going to pay the ultimate price. You sons of bitches. Even the birds die too. Everybody dies on this game. Not even just the zombies, but the women and the children. They're all monsters, and I'm gonna slaughter them like fucking monsters. Alright, well they got the best of me right there though, so... God, look at that cross. Especially right after Easter. You feel good looking at that cross right there? Oh my god. Who'd they put up there? He's a very short guy. He has tiny, tiny legs. Look at him. He has tiny arms and tiny, tiny legs on that cross. It's like they crucified a dwarf. That's not right, man. 
these people are fucking sick. Look at this cross right here. They got four four skulls on this cross. These people are monsters. Look, they got four on this one. They've murdered thousands. But today, they get their due. I'm even shooting the magicians in the fucking chess. You usually don't do that. But I had a really, really bad Easter. Oh, gold armor! That could make up for everything in my life. I'll get that stimulus check. I got the gold armor. All right. Lock and loaded. Making progress. Look, they crucified another dwarf. Poor little feller up there on the cross with tiny, tiny legs. Why would they do that to him? Killing all the birds. You don't have to kill all the birds. I choose to. That's how I roll. Everybody's gonna die on this on this episode of the Rob Patillo Entertainment System. Alright, crossing the bridge. Into a forest. If you have mushrooms, take them right now. Take them. Trip with me here in Forest of Azure. I was quoting Jim Morrison off of an American prayer. Alright, I gotta focus on the game. When I'm stuttering and losing my armor, that means I'm not doing too good in life. Alright, back on the horse, back on the horse. Ah! But that's where we start from. We got a long way to go. D don't look at the map. Don't look at the map right now. Just believe. Believe in magic. I believe in miracles. I believe in Rob. All right. God damn. Please be something good. Nope. It's a shitty dude. Ugh. All right. This is a tough part of the game right now. We gotta buckle down. Sad music. Oh my god, this is like Sarah McLaughlin. Toy Story 2. When somebody loves you. All right, lock and load. We can't forget the bigger picture. These bastards, they took my wife. It's post Easter, I had one of the shittiest Easters on record. It was so shitty I went to Netflix and I watched The Passion of the Christ myself. Usually my dad forces me to on Easter. And I miss my dad so much, I chose to watch The Passion of the Christ by myself on Easter. It was brutal. Oh my god. When, <clears throat> I'm sorry, I get... Oh. When Jesus gets whipped, like you feel, you feel it. You feel it down here. Just like I felt that death right there. Alright, come on. Come on, Rob. We're gonna do this. Not gonna let any plants kill us. If we're gonna die, we're gonna die to down on the knees of an Ed boss. Down by the knees of an Ed boss, something like that. God damn, they're sending so many demons after us, and it's raining. All right, we gotta be careful. These plants. Ah, oh. I need a drink. Don't look at that map. Do not look at the map. Okay. We're gonna take our time this time. Why do I think I can speed run this game? I'm a loser. I don't know how to speed run these games. I know how to lose though. We're gonna take our time. We're gonna get to know everybody in this game. What's your name? You and the cyclone right there. My name's Rob. Oh, crap. I was trying to adjust my pajamas and that guy came up from behind. Oh, I should have died right there. Did you see where I paused it? I'm going to save right there. We got to start saving. I told you that. See, that's why we save. That is why we save so we can load. It's like the Matrix part two. Okay. Oh, that part's so hard. They're sending like 4,000 plants and they're all shooting at us. Oh, and the vines are growing everywhere. We got to cheat like hell right now, but that's how we win our championships. WrestleMania is this weekend. Okay. 
It's okay if you've admitted to yourself you're the bad guy on this game to cheat. Look at those judging trees in the background judging your life. Look at that tree judging you right there. All right, let's save. And let's clear our minds. This isn't an easy game. Think about Jean-Claude Van Damme in Bloodsport. Remember when he got blinded by the salt? Me either, but I was pretty stoned when I watched this. It's a pretty dramatic scene. These hands! These hands! Oh no! Bright No! Pretty, pretty dramatic stuff from Jean-Claude Van Damme. All right. Let's get back into this. No, I do not want that. All right, let's do this. Kicking ass ah, on top of a plant. Let's load. I'm sorry. I was deleting junk mail from the chat room and I should get some moderators. That would be good for me. I don't have eight arms. Somebody was trying to put up porn. I have to like play this game and delete porn from the chat room. Nobody told me there'd be days like these. John Lennon, 1980. Nobody told me there'd be days like these. Nobody told me there'd be days like these. Strange days indeed. Strange days indeed. All right, there's the boss. Look at that son of a bitch. He's like 20 feet tall. He should kick our ass, but he doesn't. Ah! Okay, we start from there though. Game over. Game's just started, motherfucker. Ah! We're gonna do this. Ooh, wah! Don't look at the map. No one needs to see the map. We are far away. That's all you need to know. All right, let's get this son of a bitch. I'm turning up the music. I want this music pumping in your eardrums. Okay, here we go, here we go. We gotta stay away. This guy's 20 feet tall. One eye and an arm, a weird arm. And God only knows what he does if he gets you in that arm probes you, explores you, but we won. We don't have to worry about that fucking arm ever again. And we go to the hardest part of the game right here, Turtle Village. This shit is Normandy. Jesus Christ, it rains turtles, and then they send turtles behind you. All right, locked and loaded. K-Pimp's here with the Robbie Motes. Thank you, dude. I just had to delete a lot of porn from the chat room, so that's huge. K, uh, KJ went to the uh, Joshua Tree. How was that, dude? Did you go? Did you trip? Did you take mushrooms? Did you explore yourself, dude? Talk to me. All right. Locked and loaded. God damn, these turtles. It's not easy. It's not easy, man. We just got to cl clear our minds. Ooh, treasure chest, treasure chest. Kicking ass, kicking ass. I'm a duck. I can still make it, though. Yes, I made it. I'm saving. Hell of a run. Hell of a run. They tried to turn me into a fucking duck, and I said, you know what? I'm still going to win. All right. Hell of a run right now. Here we go. Ooh, I do love this part of the game, though. Hold on. Oh, wow. KJ, you want to get sushi with me this week? That's great. Okay. I like pretending like this guy's going to the bathroom right here. It's beautiful. Wait a minute. What's that fucking turtle doing right there? That turtle. Yeah, get out of here. That turtle's not supposed to be there. I killed all the turtles already. Ah, oh, this bridge. Somebody better call Joe Biden or OSHA, man. There's holes in this bridge. There's holes on this game. <laughs> McCheese is saying I scared off the turtle with my nudity. Look at this guy, he's naked. But he looks like Conor McGregor. Look at him, he's jacked. Is somebody changing the tires on this guy's truck? Because this dude is jacked. Look at him, look at him. Oh, KJ is letting us know he's in line at a store right now. He'll be right back. What store, what store? Where are you in line? Maybe we want something. Oh! gonna be digested over a thousand years in that shitty creature's stomach all right let's do this again all right kj's in target dude get me some cereal 
Get me some Lucky Charms Frosted Flakes. They're making those new hybrid cereals where they're like combining two to three cereals into one cereal. Give me some Rice Krispie Treat Lucky Charms. Awesome, dude. I appreciate that. Let's get lobster rolls. In Southern California, I know a lot of people I know in Massachusetts are like, why are you bragging about getting lobster rolls? Because in California, it's like caviar. It is like fucking caviar to get a good Maine lobster roll in California. And they charge like $31. And that's post-COVID prices. $31 in Pasadena. So if somebody wants to come down and have a good main lobster roll with this dude. I won't wear the giraffe outfit. This is only because it's post-holiday depression. Let's do it. Let's get some main lobster rolls in Pasadena. Let's live the American dream. That's the only way I'll cure the blues from Easter. All right, here we go. Run, run, run. Oh, it's going to be close. Yes. Cleared it. Don't notice that shitty dude up on the skulls. Oh, he came down. Get out of here. Go away. Think about your life. There you go. Get out of here. Fire bats. Just keep your... Oh, they all ganged up on me. That shitty dude and the fire bats. But we're going to do this. If you guys need anything, KJ's at Target right now. Maybe a subscription to this channel? All right. Locked and loaded. We're almost at the next boss. Exciting times. Oh, I lost my voice right there. That was crazy. Okay, I'm back. Me, 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 me. Okay. Oh, yes. It's a lot of smooth moves right there. And look at the son of a bitch. A fire dog. Fire dog. Oh, I put the chat over half the screen. That's not going to help me. That doesn't help anybody when I put the... See, every time he goes to the left of the screen, all your damn chat words are on. That damn chat box. I shouldn't have put put it over there. It's... Oh, I still beat him, even though I had a blind spot with the chat room. Ah, oh, that was great. Don't look at the map. <laughs> Don't look. We still got a long way to go. These bastards did awful things. They sent Russian bots all over Twitter, voting for Trump. Look at these little shitty dudes. They got these knights coming out of the goddamn walls, and they're wearing purple velvet. It's not a pretty scenery. Oh, son of a bitch, that suicide bat got me. It's like a bat goblin. And I'm dressed as a giraffe, if you're wondering. And yes, I had a rough Easter. I need that dagger, though. That could make up for everything in my real life. Oh, that's great. I got a dagger. I'm in my underwear. This is the best I've been all day. Son of a bitch. Look at him. Connor McGregor. Keep going, dude. Keep going, Connor. All right. This is my favorite part of the whole game. The Island of Tongues. But these are helping tongues. They're not hurtful tongues. There's a tongue right there. Watch that. These tongues help you. They'd be like the helicopters in Vietnam that would get you out on a ladder and back to your family that would never appreciate you. Did you kill people over there, Johnny? All right, but we made it to the tongues. Don't look at the map. It does nobody any good. We got a long way to go. All right, look at these tongues, though. They help us. They're purple. I bet you they're wet. And we got to ride them for all there were. All right. Doing really good with these tongues right now. Oh, that damn fly. Oh, it kind of helped me right there. I would have fell to my death. Don't ever forget that fly. That fly helped me. It like sacrificed its body so I could live. Ah, oh, that was beautiful. All right, let's do this. 
These tongues and these flies, everybody's helping me on this round. It almost makes up for everybody hating me in real life. A lot of haters. Because I'm still happy. And they don't want me happy. Because I'm a creative type. And most of the people I went to high school with settled long ago in their lives. And they don't like seeing me in Southern California playing video games dressed as a giraffe. One of them broke my nose. Bullies. But we're going to shine right now. We're going to play some ghouls and ghosts. Thank you, Daddy-O. I know I can make it. And that's why we need to survive. You know, if, if for no better reason than to just piss off our enemies. Because every time we post really sad shit on Facebook, our enemies are sitting in a dark room, drinking our tears and eating cheese and assorted meats. So we need to shine. Even if we're sad, be your own best friend. Buy yourself a dessert. Get a Twitch stream. Try to make yourself happy. Because those bastards want you unhappy. And if you survive long enough, you can see your enemies fucking fall apart. On their Facebook, on their Instagram. Trust me, they will. Shitty people don't survive for too long. Sooner or later, they'll make critical errors. Sooner or later, they'll make mistakes. And sooner or later, you're gonna prevail. Because you're a fucking champion. They're made out of cat shit. You're made out of champagne. Don't ever forget that. All right. We're at the third boss already. Making a lot of progress here on the Rapatello Entertainment System. Ah, oh, this son of a bitch. <laughs> the storm. But we can't be afraid of the storm. We are the storm. Ooh, wah! But we lost. We lost. But we're going to be back. We're going to be back. And we are right here. Look at this. Better than ever. We can't forgive these guys. These guys fucked our wife. Son of a bitch. You remember that from Raging Bull. I know you do. Robert De Niro yelling at Joe Pesci. Did you fuck my wife? Did you fuck my wife? And that's what we got to do right now. We got to scream at the top of our lungs. I don't care if you're in Target. I don't care where you are. Did you fuck my wife? Ooh, wah! Oh, we're getting this son of a bitch good. Oh, he's turning into a shitstorm. There's a lot of chat. <laughs> There's a lot of words in the chat room right now. I can't read it because... Okay, I can read it now. <laughs> JJ McCheese likes my quote. They're made out of cat shit. You're made out of champagne. He wants it on a sign in the live, laugh, love font. Well, make that. I mean, we need art. I'm sure you're an artist. Make that sign. Thank you very much for remembering that quote. I felt like we were on... We were in the zone on that level, dude. Did you did you guys see the moves I was pulling off when I was making that speech? Hold on, I'm an old... Ugh. I look like the guy in the Metallica video right now. New blood joins this earth! And quickly he's subdued! Wah! All right, let's keep going. We, we need progress. Okay. Armor! Yes! That's progress. That's progress right before your fucking eyes. We're doing it. We're really living the dream right now. Oh, oh, but we got hit. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save. We're doing really good right now. These bastards have no souls, just like your enemies in real life. They're hollow. They already sold out at 23 because their old man could get him a job at the company. But not you. Not you. You took the road less traveled. You, you kept out there. Sure, some nights you had to sleep in a band jam space, wash in a public restroom, but you did it because you're a warrior. And that's why we're here together now, playing video games, figuring shit out together. Your enemies are not going to like this. They prefer that you're home with your pants around your goddamn ankles crying. But you're not gonna do that, are you? You're gonna get their pants around their goddamn ankles and you're gonna make them cry. Cause they're made out of cat shit and you're made out of champagne. You're a champion. You make the rules. You set the pace. You get killed sometimes. It doesn't matter. 
All right, let's load again. That's right, Warhawk249. You came in at the perfect time. Your enemies don't want you here, but I want you here. Learning, studying. Oh, that was a sick move right there. I'm saving again. I had somebody from my high school on Facebook DM me last week, and they're like, so are you a star yet? What a loaded fucking question. What a swamp witch suit. <laughs> she was a swamp witch. I shot right back at her. I'm like, how's that fashion career going? Because she wanted to be a fashion designer in high school. And there was just shit posting on a Sunday morning. It was ugly. On a Sunday morning shit post. I'm wishing Lord that I got stoned. Remember that song from Johnny Cash? <laughs> Ask her how Shrek is. Thank you. She's still a swamp witch. No, she's gorgeous. Everybody who DMs me from my high school is hot. I hate that. I, none of the ugly girls are getting in touch. And So are you a star yet? I haven't seen you on TV. What are you doing out there? I'm smoking weed. And I'm playing ghouls and ghosts dressed as a giraffe. Ooh, wah! Yeah. She's my enemy. I mean, she doesn't want me to do good. What if I told her I was in the new Adam Sandler movie? You think that would make that Swamp Witch happy? Oh, I didn't see you in it. Oh, I heard it's not a good movie. You know, fuck these Swamp Witches. They're your enemies. I was on the Gong Show on ABC. You know, the Gong Show, God damn it, that's something. Mike Myers hosted, you know, and these fucking people from my high school, these Swamp Witches. Oh, I didn't watch it. Oh, did you do good? I can't stay up that late. It was on a Thursday night at 10 p.m. on national television. You could have stayed up that late. You stay up that late to fucking show your yoga poses on Instagram. Oh, look at this. I can't believe I'm in Maine right now doing yoga. I can believe it because you have a sugar daddy and he pays for you to go up to Maine so you can take stupid yoga poses and take pictures for Instagram and be like, oh my God, I can't believe I'm doing this. Never give up on your dreams. No, never give up on your husband's income, you swamp witch. Okay. <laughs> JJ McCheese is saying that she's just jealous she never beat the gong. I did beat the gong on that goddamn show. They tried to gong me. They tried to troll me. Just like everybody tries to troll me. They try to take me down a notch. They see hope in my eyes. And they want to remove that hope. Never forget your enemies are going to try to remove all the hope in your eyes. They'll do it through passive aggressive comments. How's your little TV show doing? I saw the link. I didn't click on it. Didn't you post about it on Facebook? Oh, I can't click on those at work. I'm sorry, Rob. Were you swearing again? Were you swearing on that video? I can't click on the link, Rob. I have children. I can't. You swamp witch, you never could click on the link. You can click on your boyfriend's link and let him get you pregnant while he stills landscaping in Danvers, Massachusetts. You can click on his link, right? You just can't click on my link. You know, I'm making fire art, but you want to... Fucking click onto the link of some fucking Bitcoin hundred air. We're in warm up pants and eating chicken parmesan subs in Malden, Massachusetts. Son of a bitch. I am surrounded right there by spiky weed, but not in real life. I'm surrounded by good weed. You know, like. <laughs> All right, we got to keep going. Because our enemies want us to give up. If we're creative types, they want us to go on Facebook and start saying, I'm depressed, I can't get a job as an artist. Nobody's buying my music. They want that, they want you to type that. So they can sit in their bedrooms that their landscaping husband paid for, and they can laugh at you for still trying to get off the beaten road. But I see a warrior, and we're gonna be warriors together. That's how we got these goddamn belts that are fanny packs, but they're belts. All right, we're going to do this together. Our enemies want us on Facebook right now, whining how we didn't get the stimulus check, but we're not. We're going to take pictures of us smoking marijuana and post it in our Tom Brady jerseys, living large. Or Michael Jordan, I mean, Tom Brady voted for Trump.
So, all right, let's rise to the occasion. Let's do this. I got the best weapon in the game. I got everything. Jesus, JJ McCheese has the Gettysburg address up on the chat. Look at this. This is like three paragraphs. Our enemies want us to click on the link for their Pokemon yoga pants pyramid schemes and like pictures of their ugly kids. Was that meant to be a uh, Pokemon? What you wrote right there? Oh, God damn it. They got me in my underwear. Your enemies want you in your underwear too. They want you vulnerable. I don't go to any of my high school gra Oh, it's a brand, Lulu Mom. Okay. Well, there. I don't know about it. I'm sorry. I'm a piece of shit. Put me up on the cross. Bring me out back and shoot me. All right, let's try this again. <sighs> Can't give up. We do not want to give up right now. Our enemies want us to give up go on Facebook tomorrow, be like, the road is too hard, I can't make it. And they're sitting at home, their landscaping husband's income, and they're laughing at you. And they're like, you fool, you should have ever, never ever tried to sell your music or your stupid paintings or your sci-fi writings. You should have stayed in your basement apartment and cried, but you rose. And sure, you maybe you didn't make any money, but you can pretend it looks like you made money on Facebook and confuse your enemies. Always buy... Uh, hold on. Don't be afraid to boost posts on Facebook. Always cheat and lie. Smoke screens and covers. Make your enemies cry. That's all the bottom line is. Go to Vegas and rent a hooker and take a photo with that hooker and be like, this is my new girlfriend. I can't believe things are really happening. You want your enemies going crazy at their houses. Oh my God. That girl's hot, he's in Vegas right now. You gotta throw smoke screens, I'm, I'm shitting you not. If you go on Facebook again and start complaining about your surgery or how depressing your life is, you're not doing anybody any favors. Your enemies are drinking your tears. You have to go up there and just put up photos. Maybe you're not even in the photos and you're gonna have to Photoshop yourself into those photos and your enemies are gonna see them and they're gonna shiver because they know you're rising, even if it's sort of Photoshopped, but we don't have to know that, you know? Ah, we lost, but we made it to the turtle. We're on the back of a turtle. I'm going to show you the front of this turtle. Watch this shit. We're going to go to the front of this thing. Look at the front of this disgusting creature. This is like all your fucking ex-high school friends. Look at it. Dirty teeth. Miserable rat eyes. These people want you to fail as an artist in life. While they just sit on their assholes all day in their cubicle paying $70 for Roger Waters' new box set. Meanwhile, they'll never go to one of your shows. They'll never pay a dollar for your band camp single. They're just giving you a double middle finger. They'll pay 90 to $200 to go see Fish and you 2 at the Madison Square Garden, won't they? But they're not gonna ever pay for your art. Why? Because if you made it as an artist, it inadvertently points out the shackles on their own ankles. They don't want that. They don't want to see you basking in your artistic glory in Paris, France. France? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm doing like 12 things at once right now. All right, I was saving the game. Where was I? Oh yeah, they don't want you basking in glory in Paris, France with Quentin Tarantino. Paris, France. Well, I'm trying to do two things here, all right? I'm a human boy. <gasps> that anarchist dog, I didn't know you came in here. Wow. Can we just pause it and salute that anarchist dog? That's VIP right there. I'm going to show my cat for you. That's Red the Cat. That's what you get when you're a VIP. That's my cat. Oh my God, Vermin Supreme. Somebody just pressed a Vermin Supreme. Okay, is this paused? Okay, we got to do a little Vermin Supreme. We will milk him in the sun. He's a boy cow and he's milking. Let us milk him in the sun. Boy cow, baby. Orange, There's Vermin Supreme, man. Oh, I gotta get my face off the picture. <laughs> those cops loved us. God bless those cops. My name is Rob. I'm from All right. That was Vermin Supreme. Man. 
That anarchist dog, thank you for showing up. All right, let's do this. Let's beat this goddamn turtle. It's got gross on its back. Sometimes you, you know what? I gotta also bring back up the soundtrack. It's not good unless we have the soundtrack. God, I should be working at a shitty, a, a real shitty radio station around Boston nobody listens to again. I know how to work the knobs. I know how to remove mango worms from the back of this turtle. You ever see those videos? Oh, God damn it. The worm came right from underneath me. That wasn't fair. But life isn't fair. Your enemies, they were probably born on third base acting like they hit a triple. Their dad's probably making a half a million dollars. And they're going to the same high school you're going to, judging you. Putting duct tape on your ass cheeks in the gym class. The locker room. <clears throat> God damn it. I need a drink. Don't look at the map. We still have a long, long way to go. Oh, pause. I'm drinking. I'm working the knobs. I'm doing everything tonight. <clears throat> you never would have guessed that I had a horrible Easter. I was in a fetal position. I was staring at my crotch for two hours. I was thinking about my enemies and how they were enjoying Easter with their families. And the next day, today, I bought myself some store-bought sushi. And now I laugh at my enemies because they still have those miserable children. And they still have to flip the bill for, foot the bill for Easter. <laughs> it's a very expensive holidays. I'm sorry, I'm trying to get these worms. I gotta save more often. Okay, here we go. Kicking ass. And what are our, you know, you guys, what are our enemies doing right now? They're at home. They're not watching the stream. They're probably putting their miserable children in bed. And expensive bed sheets that they're going to have to spend the rest of their lives working to pay off. Ah. <sighs> I haven't gone to any of my high school reunions. I won't go to any of my high school reunions. Same reason why I wouldn't go to Dallas, Texas if I was a president. You know? It's just a place where they can, you know, old classmates can assassinate you. Don't go to those reunions. Unless you're bringing a Russian mail order bride and you, you can lie and say you worked in Silicon Valley and. You don't have to sit at the same table with them. Yeah. What are, what are your enemies doing right now? You know, those kids who used to make fun of you in high school, call you Conehead, call you Rob Potato. Oh, wow, JJ McCheese just subscribed. No. No, that's great. That's great. But I'm, I'm trying to talk about my enemies right now. But that's wonderful, man. Here, just for that, I'll show you the cat. Sexual, sexual by nature. You gotta pet her really slow. She's a sexual, sexual cat. All right. Yeah, that anarchist dog brought up a great point. Our enemies right now, they're using their save states on their marriages. We're using our save states to get through the game. Yeah, Red the Cat. You know what, I'll show you this. You know, you're bringing up Red the Cat. The Red the Cat emoji. Look at that, boom. If you become a special member of the Rob Patillo fan club on Twitch, you can use the red emoji too. Look at that. Beautiful sexual cat. Ooh, wow, we're kicking ass. I better save right there. And um, put up a couple more emojis in the chat room. What else we got? We got Robbie Road Steamer. <laughs> Ooh, you got Rob Patillo in cartoon form. I got Rob Patillo in real form, though. Look at that shit. All right. All right. All right, we're saving. And we're loading. And we're going to get these motherfuckers. Because they got my wife. They kidnapped her out of the back of Target. I was in Target with my wife. And we were debating whether or not we should get saved. Private Ryan. No, don't save. Oh, my God. No. Did you see what I did there? I mentioned 
the movie Saving Private Ryan. Instead of loading, I was about to save again. That would have sucked. God damn it. All right. I'm just going to focus on the game. These sh this is like the toughest part. They send like 10 demons. Look at this. 10 demons at once. They got a dragon coming out. I'm going to save right there. I think that is some amazing footwork. Let's use the second slot. Daddy-O, thank you for the Rob emotes. JJ McCheese, thank you. Just just let the chat room rain with Rob emotes right now. It'll really cheer up my Monday. It's been a rough Monday. I had to take a shower when I was in the mood to. Do you hate that? Do you hate taking showers and you don't want to put your body under the water? <sighs> but we got to take those showers. You know that, right? You know we got to take those showers. We also got to load where we were. Warhawk's right. A shower when you're not in a good mood sucks ass. It is not a fun experience. Look at this. It's like seven on one right now. That's why I'm saving, because they're cheating too. There's... Jesus, they got the whole gang. Oh, there's armor right there. Yeah, when you don't want to take a shower, you want to sit in bed. You want to watch the Kennedy assassination, both of them, a hundred times on YouTube and listen to Elliot Smith and think about your kidney problems or your enemies. And that's what they want you to do. They want you to stay in bed. Why? Because then they get out of bed and they make money you're not making. While you're sitting there, looking at your crotch, wondering why. All right, thank God I saved right there. Why? Why does this happen to me? I was a chosen one. Jesus Christ. Look at how many enemies they got right there. It's a military style ambush from start to finish right there. All right, we gotta clear our minds. Let's just get to the next part, God damn it. I wanna play some other games tonight and I don't like leaving games as a loser. And if I have to cheat to leave this arena as a champion, I'll do that. Your enemies are cheating too, don't ever forget that. If you're debating whether or not you should cheat on something, just remember, your enemies are willing to hit you with a steel chair in life. So make sure you get that steel chair first. Intercept it if it gets thrown into the ring and hit them with it really hard. And then have your friend distract the referee while you crawl on top and you do your dirty finishing move. My move is called the company car. It's the camel clutch. And I get on the back of the person. Oh, nice. Warhawk 249 is going to swanton bomb the enemies. Yeah, you can do that. I like to make them tap out, though. You know? There's nothing more undignifying than a good guy tapping out when you don't legitimately deserve to tap them out. You know? Because you hit them a hundred times with a chair. Like this fly. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Yes! See? Oh my god, the walls of Patillo, the walls of Jericho. What a great finishing move. Oh, this son of a bitch. We're at the final guy, the final shitty dude. Just gotta keep hitting him. Forget about our enemies and just keep hitting that son of a bitch. We gotta get him right in the head. Yes! Woo! We did it! Son of a bitch. We rise. We rise. What are our enemies doing right now? What are our enemies doing right now? They're not celebrating beating ghouls and ghosts. Hell yeah. That goes out to that anarchist dog, Daddy-O, Warhawk, JJ McCheese, KJ Pimp. You guys believed in me tonight, man. I was alone. I was in sweatpants, sitting in bed. Smelling my hands, looking at the internet for 9-11 was an inside job videos, and I didn't believe. I was like, you know what? I'm not going to do that Twitch stream tonight. Nobody cares anymore. Nobody cares about me and my boy thoughts. I'm going to sit in bed, and I'm going to turn up the depressing music. I'm going to listen to Jimi Hendrix, Little Wing. He died. He died. I feel like I could die, you know? But no, man. We got on Twitch. And you guys, you got on Twitch, and we did it together. And our enemies right now, they're eating lean, cold cuisine. 
and they're watching Friends reruns with their shitty spouses, watching their ugly cabbage kids grow. And we're champions right now. Thank you, JJ McCheese. You're on fire tonight. I'm glad you subscribed. What is this shit? People's souls, which has been captured. There's a lot of information. I don't know what I feel about that, but I know what I feel about you guys. Give you some goddamn best emojis you've ever seen in your life. Red emojis. I'm gonna line the room with red. Look at that cat. She's a beautiful, beautiful Pasadena feeding cat. <sighs> Alright. Kind of a shitty ending, because they're just showing us what we've already done. Like, show us new shit. Okay? I've had to do this. I know what I've done. I already played this level. Show me, like, my wife. She's in my bedroom. The townspeople are cheering me. I make love to her. We make an heir to the throne. I mean, I've already done this shit. Why show me old shit? Show me new. Sh <sighs> we remember this guy. He was a loser. We beat him. Just like we're going to beat all our enemies. What are they doing right now? They're on Facebook. Liking Gandhi quotes. Sharing Jimmy Fallon clips. Raw deal, man. But you guys are real. You're right here. We battled these damn creatures together as champions. Remember this? We had to remove the mango worms from the back of this creature. Ugh. Bot flies. You ever seen those bot flies get removed on YouTube from people's bodies? Remember this shithead we beat? We're champions. What do you guys want to play now? We beat this game. Remember this shithead? Jeff Bezos. Steven Miller. Oh, there we are. Me and my beautiful, beautiful wife. Oh. <laughs> Vector Man. We could play. Yeah, Jeff Bezos is the final boss in that game, Warhawk. Very good. I mean, kind of looks like Jeff Bezos. That kind of looks like Donald Trump in the sky up there, too. Let's get out of this game. Let's play something that's meaningful, sacred. A sacred game we can all get behind. I had a request for Vector Man from Two Cute Brothers. Let's play this. Let's play Vector Man. He's a wild, crazy shit. Blue Sky Software. This is for you, two cute brothers, Vector Man. I wish he was as successful as Sonic the Hedgehog. Vector Man got a raw deal. Oh, you love the music, always. I'll turn up the music for you. This is your night. JJ McCheese, listen. And feast on Vector Man. Let's go see the options first. I might want to make it a little easier considering I haven't played before. All right, where are the options? Show me the options. Options. Okay, I've seen the beginning already. You don't have to load the whole beginning up again. Getting a little crazy. Starting the game, press start. Okay, options, options, options. Difficulty, no, lame. I want lame difficulty. Okay, we're ready. Okay. Wow, KJ got my cereal. I told K-Pimp to get my cereal at Target. Thank you. Let's get lobster rolls this week in Pasadena, dude. Let's figure shit out together. Okay, Earth. It's 20... <clears throat> it's 2049. Get this belt off of me. Get the zipper down. Let's play this damn game. Humanity has escaped to the stars, leaving mechanical ore bots to clean up. This looks kind of artsy. Day one. All right. This looks pretty easy. This dude's got a gun. I just killed somebody, my first confirmed kill. 
This looks pretty fun. Look at this. I haven't played too much Vector Man. I gotta tell you guys, it feels really good to kill people in this game. Like, real fulfilling. You can really feel it. <laughs> Talk like a Bostonian. So, dude, these fucking characters in this game are wicked queer. Look at this guy. Look at the fucking wicked... Fuck him up, dude. Dude probably f fucking sucks Derek Cheetah's pole, guy. This guy wants to be in a locker room, bathroom with Derek Jeter and A-Rod. Ugh. Jesus, this is a tough game, dude. Okay, let's try it one more time. You picked a tough one, man. God. What else can I do? Oh, what was that? I could fly. Oh, this is fucking stupid, man. <laughs> I beat Street Fighter, dude. You can watch it on the replay. K-Pimp say any miss Street Fighter. You know what? I gotta do this right now. I'm sorry. I apologize. I got a runny nose. I gotta be honest. I do. It's not cocaine, but I just don't want to have a runny nose. It's not COVID, so don't think I got the Rona. It's not Coke nose. Don't say it's Coke nose, KPM. No, it's not. It's not bleeding. I just, I was debating. I'm like, should I get a napkin or bandana and wipe my nose? Because I know a lot of you in the chat room are going to judge me. Okay. I'm going to try this game one more time. This being that one more time. And we're going to move to another game. What do you guys want to play next? I didn't snort a line of fentanyl. Oh, shoot the TVs, two cute brothers are saying. Where are the TVs? Oh, oh, those. Okay. Ah, progress. Why didn't you tell me that before? I don't know how to play this game. Shoot the TVs. Okay, okay. Made a little bit of progress. I can't play Duck Hunt. It's a Sega Genesis. I'd have to get a Zappa. I'd have to invest a lot of money. I'm losing money on this Twitch channel. Every time I Twitch, I'm losing like $20. Oh, look at this. What the hell am I now? A little ballerina. This is a fun game. Kind of European. Still fun. It's a wicked queer game to a wicked pizza. I don't know how to control this guy. He's like Gumby, dude. This guy's like a wicked flaming Gumby. I shot another TV, though. Gonna shoot my fucking wad this weekend, dude. I'm dating a Revere 7. Yes, I have played Castlevania Bloodlines. You want to play that next? Let's do that. But I'm doing good at this game now. I know now to shoot the TVs. So I've made a lot of progress. Okay. It's a good game. It just, it's the same thing a bunch though. I, I, it probably changes later on and I'm getting my ass kicked. But JJ McCheese, you're up. We're gonna play Castlevania Bloodlines. These bastards. They also stole my fucking wife. Konami, dude. You know it's good. You know it's fucking good when you see that Konami. Hell yeah. Castlevania, it's simple. You don't have to shoot TVs. You got a whip. <laughs> Warhawk saying that he's starting to think maybe I let my wife get stolen so I could collect the insurance money. Maybe. I don't know. You don't get a lot and then they send the adjuster to your house and how did you lose her? Oh well a demon took her. That's hard. Yeah. 
When you saw the old school Konami symbol, you knew it was a good game. This one's a good one. The Ruins of Dracula's Castle. Drugula's Castle. Dig through the ditches and burn through the witches and drag in the back of my Dracula. That's what we gotta do. We gotta dig through the ditches, burn through the goddamn witches, and slam in the back of my Dracula. Warhawk saying that a demon taking my wife would fall under act of God and the insurance wouldn't cover that. Yeah. So if we lost our wife in this game in Castlevania, the only way we're gonna win is if we get her back. We can't go to the insurance people and say we lost our wife. Act of God, you're right. I might make you a moderator, Warhawk. You, you, you're smart. You, you say smart shit. I need people to say that in the chat room. Sometimes people go in the chat room and they say mean shit about my body. I have to ban them. Because that's bad. Alright. Kicking a little bit of ass in the castle. Warhawk puts the smart in smart ass. Nice. But I don't need you to be a smart ass. I need you to be an enforcer of justice in the chat room. There's some monsters in there sometimes. Bitter. Bitter that I'm shining in life. Bitter that I'm playing Castlevania and goddamn giraffe onesie. I can't help it. This is the life God gave me. This is why I ran away to California with China. I was living in a band jam space in Cambridge, Massachusetts, and I, I was doing a lot of video work and stuff, and I was like, you know what? I want to make comedy videos with China. What is she doing now? And she was in Japan. So I found a director for her documentary and we got her back to America. And she brought me here to California where I can dress up as a giraffe and I don't have to worry about mass holes being like, dude, what are you, wicked queer? Dude, why are you wearing the uh, giraffe onesie guy? Are you swinging for the Yankees? Goddamn bats. <sighs> Alright, it's locked down. We're playing Castlevania. We're playing Bloodlines Castlevania. We got a live chat room. There's a lot of bats here. And we're going to buckle down. We're going to kick ass at this game. I'm not just a pretty face in a giraffe onesie. I know how to play these games. It's time to show off. Going to kill some bats. These bats fuck my wife. These bats fuck my wife. I don't know if they did that, but I'm pissed. I'm pissed. I think my wife cheated on me with everybody in this game. Look at that howling wolf. You piece of shit. You took the dirty deal. You think I'm afraid of you? I'm gonna whip the shit out of you in front of your parents. You should have been a helper dog. A therapy puppy. And instead, you took a shitty deal. Alright. Oh, I thought that was the end of round one. I celebrated prematurely. I was ready to smoke some weed and read all the wonderful positive comments in the chat room and that didn't happen because we still have to fight. God! Bloodlines is tough, man. Castlevania is humbling. I, oh my god, those skeletons. I forgot how good they are throwing the bones at you. They're like Peyton Manning. They just have pinpoint accuracy. Look at this shit. Ugh! Oh. Daddy is getting worked up. Kill all the monsters! Those monsters fucked your wife! Which bone are they throwing, though? Well, hopefully it's their arm bone and not down their bone. Oh, God. They... I gotta focus on these guys for a second. You guys are being really humorous. You're saying tight, consistent, funny lines in the chat room. And I, I, I just gotta focus in on these. Oh my god, okay. We're doing a lot better now ever since I've ignored the chat room, even though it's breaking my heart. I miss you guys. Are you guys posting funny shit right now while I'm trying to just, oh, gotta get up there. Don't think about the chat room, Rob. 
All right, kicking ass. Sort of, sort of. Oh, he's throwing his bones at me from behind. God. All right. No meat. Why, why don't they ever give me energy in this game? God. Is there any meat? Usually you can hit a wall in Castlevania and they give you like some free meat. Get your energy back up. God. More skeletons. No meat. I know. JJ McCheese is saying that the meat's hidden in some of the walls, but... Maybe this wall? Ah, oh, I need meat. I have two energy bars. And the coronavirus. My guy is sick. He needs the vaccine. Ah, oh, where is the meat? Not over there. So many skeleton guys. I'm gonna save it. Whew. A lot of progress. But a lot of scary, shitty dudes in this game, man. Okay, kicking ass, taking names, and moving forward on Castlevania. Oh, look at the size of that guy's ball! Ugh. I gotta throw the holy water at him and run. Run my ass off. It's like a grenade. Holy water, run! No, I don't have to run. Ah, We're so close. That's it. We're coming back though. We got two more continues. Kick ass. I gotta get psyched up. I gotta clear my mind. And I gotta. S <sighs> Just like Jean Claude Van Damme. He was blinded. And even though you're blind, you're gonna have to rise to the challenge. Your enemies are going to want you to stay blind, stay sad. <sighs> I'm psyched now. I'm ready. <sighs> All right, let's do this. Can't fight afraid. These guys remind me of a lot of the dudes who used to bully me in high school. Broke my nose. Brian. Brian pushed me into a pole in front of the Danvers High School library. And it looked like my nose was broke. I didn't tell my dad though. I didn't want to go to the hospital. So it kind of grew back crooked or some shit. <laughs> oh, sick emotes, JJ. Yeah. So every time I kill one of these skeletons, I think about one of those shitty landscaping hockey dudes in high school. Oh, sick mirror, I gotta get that. Yes! A lot of progress on this one, because I'm thinking about all the people I hated in high school. Most of them hate themselves. Watching Ellen every day in their big track pants with the six cabbages they made. Oh, this is my little daughter, Karen Jr. and Bobby Jr. Fuck that. The only babies I'm gonna have is save babies on this game. When I save games, when I beat games, that's the only babies we're making. Killing all these goddamn ex-high school friends of mine, enemies. Nice. I bet you the meat's right here. Yeah! Oh, there's nothing there, though. Where? There it is! Yes! Yes! I'm gonna save. We got the meat. We got everything. Whew. A lot of progress on this one. Oh, now we gotta ride up the scales of a dragon. Look at this. Oh, God, it's falling apart behind us. Get these birds out of our way. You see those birds trying to trip me up right there? Get out of here, you dirty birds! All right. Now this son of a bitch. Did you fuck my wife? Did you fuck my wife? Now I'm feeling it. We're ready. I think we're about to fight the boss. This is for you, JJ. Can't be afraid of this needle dick. Come out here, you piece of shit. Show yourself. I have the holy water too. What is it gonna be, a wolf? This old guy, look at this. Look at this, he's a mess. 
Look at this piece of shit coming out of the woodwork. Someone's gotta oil your ass. Oh shit, he's closing the ground. Closing space between us like in UFC. We gotta j hit him with a boomerang. Stay. Oh, he's got a probing stick. Did you see that? He hit me with the probing stick. I'm just gonna launch these boomerangs at him and pray that he doesn't come any closer. Oh, he's coming closer. He wants to talk to us. God damn it. He's good. I'm gonna give him that. Oh, we're so close. It's one of the closest fights you'll ever see this year. UFC pay-per-view. Oh, I'm gonna put him in the guillotine, dude. Oh, this is so close. I think we got him. I think we got him. I'm gonna whip him. Yes! Yes! That's for you, JJ. Screw that guy. Just some old, broken-down knight. You take a mortal man! Rob Patillo here on the Rob Patillo Entertainment System. Does anybody want to take down this password from 1991? It's like uh, Axe Morningstar Gem Row 1, Gem Axe 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 Row 2, Gem Axe Axe Row 3. That's all we're doing. All right. Where are we going now? To oh, Jeffrey Epstein's Island. Oh, this is Jeffrey Epstein's Island where he brought all those presidential types like Trump and Clinton. All right, kicking ass here on Castlevania for the Sega Genesis Bloodlines. I'm Bob Patillo. Coming up next, we have Phil Collins, Edie Brickell, and the New Bohemians. But first, Elton John, Candle in the Wind, Princess Die version. Goodbye, Norma Jean. Though I never knew you at all, you had the grace to do cool shit. I forgot the words. While those around you fall Crawled out of the woodwork And they tried to Bash in your brain Oh, look at that old school reflection tech You're right, J.J. McCheese Look at that I'm trying to kill people in this game And you're taking time to notice the little things That's beautiful, dude You should have been in Goodwill Hunting That's some Robin Williams shit Wow, man. Tell me other beautiful things you see on this game, man. That's great. Oh, the water's rising. You see that? We gotta move quick. Come on, come on. Jesus, the water's coming fast. Oh, we gotta fight this donkey right here. Get the hell out of... Get out of my way, man. Shit to do. All right. Jesus, the water's coming behind us, man. <sighs> Castlevania. This is intense right now. The water is slowly creeping in. Oh shit! He knocked me down. Oh god! Which one do I take? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go up these stairs. I don't want to drown, man. I have a fear of drowning. And spiders. That's it. That's how you get me. If you don't want me to show up, just bring a lot of water. Jesus, how many levels is this water? It's like an 80-story building right here. It's the World Trade Center. What the hell's going on here? I mean, this is 1991, so the World Trade Center would have still been up. Oh, this is the guy that's making all the water happen. We gotta whip him before he drowns us. Whip him. Whip him that way, and then he goes on that side, and we whip him on that side, and then we do the same thing. We get him over here. Yes! Oh, but it wasn't the boss. Damn it. Fight the piss wizard. That's what he was, McCheese. He's just pissing on us. Oh, that's the real boss. Look at that. Oh, we didn't even get a chance to see him. He just hit us with his mace. Jesus. I had like a morning star right there. All right. We get to start at the piss wizard again. Look at this guy. He just pees and tries to have us drown underneath the tidal fury of his urine. But we're going to whip him. We're going to whip him over here. We're going to get him on that side. Oh, I missed him. I missed him. Oh, he could... This is going to be close. Oh. Oh. 
I'm overthinking the whipping. One more. Oh, I almost drowned. Oh, sweet oxygen back into my lungs. Okay, now we gotta get back. There's a big boss right here. Big crabby mother... We gotta... Oh, we gotta get these bats, though. Oh, I can't whip diagonal unless I jump. That's bullshit. Oh, those birds kicked my ass before the boss. That sucked. Oh, gotta get out of the way. Jesus, he is huge. I'm gonna get close. And then tee off on him. Oh, he jumped. Alright. I got a strategy, though. Learning this on the fly. Ah, oh, the piss wizard again. Oh, I missed him. We're getting sloppy now. That happens with athletes. You start to get fatigued. You start to make mistakes. Your friends start laughing at you. You start getting DMs that you're a needle dick loser. You suck on the 12 dongs on failure. <laughs> 12 dicks of failure. I'm sorry. I'm trying to whip this guy's ass and screwing up some beautiful, beautiful poetry. All right. Okay, I can't take these birds for granted. These, oh, they're so good. They swoop. Oh, the birds. Okay, one bird, two birds, yes! They did damage, though. Now this guy. When he swings, go close. Yes! Oh, they're doing lovely! Oh, then I bragged about it, and I died. I deserve to lose right there, man. Andy F-words here. Back from eating chicken wings... Wearing animal ears and playing the kazoo on Andy F. Word. He's a good guy. We're both from the Massachusetts area. We love cheese and strap-ons and video games. Andy plays newer video games. I play older ones. You have so many skills. Radio engineer. You know how to fake a stimulus check so I get paid. Oh, I'm drowning. I'm drowning to death because I'm talking to Andy. Gah. I drowned to death because I was distracted. All right. I hope you feel good, Andy. Do they give me? I got one more. Continue, you motherfuckers. Okay, let's do this. We gotta clear our mind, though. You can do it, Jean-Claude. Even if you're blind, you can do it. <sighs> Think about Red the Cat. And let's kick some ass on our final continue. And then I'm off to a wonderful evening of running around in my giraffe onesie, sucking down whipped cream, chasing down the cat, playing with the cat, beating my roommates with cat furniture. I had an incredible night ahead of me. Oh, shit! Yes! Oh, I thought... Nice! Monday nights, man. It almost makes up for one of the shittiest Easters on record. I just want to use this. It was my beautiful Easter room. I was high yesterday. I was happy in here. This room made sense, and now I won't be able to use this room for another year. Bunny, bunny, I like bunnies. E-I-E-I-O. Are you listening to the song? This lady just took old McDonald and redid it. Didn't think she was going to get sued. Bunny, bunny, I miss bunnies. Easter sucked this year. Okay. Let's get back to the stream. Oh, Andy, you like the Easter room? Here, just for that, I'll show you my lady friend. There she is. Get that thumb sucker away from there. This thumb sucker represents me. But her, she's the real deal. I'm dressed up as an animal, too. I'm unemployed, but I'm sure. I'm sure I could talk some sense into her. All right. Rob, you're starting to understand Twitch. Like you're fucking some Jedi master. You did 
three hours of small talk running around a spaceship with four other dudes on Twitch that couldn't do any small talk either. You're telling me how to do Twitch. Did you rewire the ship's computer yet, Tom? I don't know, Andy. I tried to rewire the ship's computer. That's some heavy shit, Andy. Thank you for coming over here and telling me how to wipe my ass. All right, now I'm all worked up. <laughs> I gotta cross the pink wire with the green wire. You and your five friends on there are dead weight and you're telling me how to do my twitch. You can lick my whole a-hole, Andy. You can lick it slowly, up and down, while I extinguish this guy. I'm not going to. You're in my head, man. You're killing me. Both of you guys. It's like you're- Ugh! I'm drowning! Oxygen being removed from my lungs. Ugh. The piss wizard. I was too away. Too away from extinguishing the goddamn piss wizard. <sighs> Clear my mind. We're gonna do this. K pimp's back. You're back just in time to see the piss wizard. I've been drowned by this dude five times. Hell on earth. Nice. Nice. All right. Got all my energy. I don't have somebody telling me how to do my Twitch anymore. And we're gonna have some fun right now. These goddamn birds though. Now, just ignore the birds. No, you gotta kill the bird. Oh, God damn it. Nice. Why am I disappearing? Stop disappearing! This game is glitchy! Nice. Just like that. Oh, there's another one! Jesus, I'm gonna save it. Holy crap, they're sending everybody after us. Everybody but the kitchen sink on this run. Oh, I got an axe, though. Okay, hit and run. Nice! Yes! <sighs> Kicking a lot of ass here. No, I mean, he's slow, but I, I was pretty fast. That's the difference. All right, kicking a lot of ass on Castlevania. Let's move forward. Oh, shit. What is this? What is this? I just died. That's what it is. What the hell? <sighs> I'm actually getting a Nintendo. That's it? I'm dead? They ain't giving me no lives? My credit's no good here anymore? Ah, uh, God damn it. That part is rough. Let's go to this part. Alright. Let's do that again. We'll do this part. This part will get everybody excited. Thank God for save states. Oh, this is a creepy, creepy creature. I wonder what happens if you beat this guy, though. God damn it. The boss with the dick mouth, JJ McCheese is saying. Yes, we're fighting the boss with the dick mouth. Oh, God. He's so quick. He's throwing a bag of dicks at us, too. Oh, son of a bitch. I was down to one. Ah. Uh, let's get the dick bag. Oh, what a weird looking boss. I'm like looking at him now. That's what's killing me. Nice! We did it. We did it cheating slightly. Using save states. But we beat Castlevania. 
look at this. This is a real ending to a game. Nice. We're champions. They can't take that away from us. Revere Beach is safe once again. Kelly's Roast Beef. Route 1. Ah, the castle has been demolished. The resurrection of Dracula has been fucking stopped by kings. We beat three games tonight, guys. Now they're going to show the credits. All these people are dead. This game was like 30 years ago. Oh, thank you, KJ, for the cheers. Got some bit action going. We're looking at the names of a lot of dead people right now. K-Pimp's cheering like crazy right now. I appreciate it, man. Main designer, Bunman? Are these even real names? I like how they're crediting the monsters, too. Gargoyle. Special design, Tat. Gear steamer. This lady was another bad guy in the game. We didn't have to fight. Because I used save state. So we didn't have to see her. She was a mess anyways. <laughs> Let's put K-Pimp's cheers in the middle. He's lighting it up. We don't need to see the names of these jabronis who made the game. I want to see K-Pimp giving bits. Ah, look at all those bits. You're the real champion, KJ. <laughs> JJ McCheese, time to mosh! I'll put up some emojis too. We got Red. Red the Cat. Robbie Road Steamer! What other emojis? Level 4 Robotillo emojis. Should make one for China. That would be nice. Down the line, we have a nice China emoji. And that's it. 1994 Konami. OJ Trial. Dave Matthews Band was just getting going. It's a wild time. And just like that, the end of Castlevania. Bring ourselves back to the main menu. Look at all these beautiful games. We beat three of them tonight. We beat Street Fighter, even though we did it on easy, but I had a bad fucking Easter. I deserve to beat Street Fighter on easy. The game calls you out, though, for it. They wouldn't let me see the real ending to Street Fighter because they said I played it on a crappy, difficult level. So, I'm gonna. I, I want to make this around two hours. Be the longest stream I've done yet. Be pretty heroic. I think I'm gonna close off on Mickey Mouse's creepy house of dicks. It'll be beautiful. KJ wants to know what I did on Easter. I was in this room. I was in this room. I smoke weed. I cried on my bed a little bit. I'm looking over at my bed. I listened to Phil Collins a lot yesterday, Against All Odds, and I thought about ex-girlfriends and why none of them are getting uglier. They're all getting hotter. I thought... I thought at least one of them would go down, but they're all leveling up. Bunch of Boston sixes turning into Boston sevens. 
I had one of those Jimmy Dean breakfast bowls yesterday. That was the highlight of my Easter. I'll buy like the breakfast bowl because I got a polycystic kidney disease, so I can't have too much of the meat or potatoes. I can't process potassium anymore. Look at this mouse. I had one of those and I made a bunch of breakfast sandwiches out of them. And that was my Easter. What did you do, K-Pimp? Did you trip at the Joshua Tree with your lady friend? <laughs> did you trip like Mickey's tripping right now? Like, oh, I'm tripping. Oh, look at me. I'm on mushrooms at the Joshua Tree. That's the best Mickey you'll hear on Twitch. Oh, Warhawk, thank you. Thank you for saying it's been a great stream. We got nine minutes left. JJ McCheese is turning in. K-Pimp is saying that if you date ugly chicks, you can only go up from there. Well, I don't know. I'm pretty ugly. I got bad kidneys. Sort of a failure as an artist, according to a lot of my ex-high school friends who are judging me on DMs. I got the cat. I don't need to date. Oh, Mickey just got his asshole handed to him. This game is deceptively difficult. I gotta clear my mind. In the Listen sun, to this song. In the sun, we will milk him in the sun. He's a boy cow, he needs milking. Let us milk him in the sun. Gonna go to Orange Julius and get a hot dog. Come That's on. Vermin Supreme right there. Here we go. Put me down there. It'll be a little safe spot for me. My name is Rob. I'm from Boston. I should have married this lady cop when I had a chance in New York. I'm really like swooning right now. She could have helped me figure things out together. This was in North Carolina. I was trying to sing to these beautiful cops after they busted the Occupy the DNC camp. Somebody put a condom in my dreams. I'm playing Pearl Jam for these hot cops in North Carolina. That's a great Pearl Jam riff. I suck at Pearl Jam. He likes it in the back. You see that head cop. This is in Washington. I'm singing to the horses, the police horses. This is during Trump's inauguration. This was in Boston. Singing Phil Collins to the cops. Do you remember? Okay, just try it, you know. Sometimes I get back up vocals. I'll do it on my own. That's how Collins had to go to from Genesis. Oh, thank you, KJ. You're a success in my book, too, man. Looks like you have an awesome family. You're out in California. <laughs> this gets loud. At the strip club. Come on. Hot dogs and applesauce. One time. Hot dogs and applesauce. Come on. Hot dogs and applesauce. Hot dogs and applesauce. Gotta vote for Berman and then get a free party. Sing it. Hot dogs and applesauce. And maybe get married one day. That's awesome. I'm going to bring it back to the Easter room. Got a couple more minutes. This has been a very beautiful Monday. Thank you, guys. I'm going to have a Trace Leches wet cake after this. Beautiful wet cake. Cake in a cup. I got that at the supermarket today. A lot of magic. KJ sent me a hundred cheers. Thank you, man. That's huge. Look at that. I'm looking at that right now. You know what? In return, let me send you a bunch of Robbie Road Steamer cheers. Look at that. Boom. Right back at you. I'll send you a bunch of Red the Cat cheers too. Boom. You know Red the Cat. Sexual cat. God bless her. Let's finish off this damn mouse game and call it a night, guys. This has been beautiful. Yeah. Oh, my God, KJ. That's pierogi, the Polish dumpling cat. 
That's her nickname. Her name's Red, but yeah, I do call her Pierogi. All right. We got five minutes left. Just going to be Mickey Mouse. Going to go through this beautiful forest. Going to think about my enemies. Hope they're suffering tonight on their Monday night. Sucking on Chobani yogurt in front of their Cabbage Patch kids. Miserable children. But we're shining. We're playing Mickey Mouse for the Sega Genesis. And we can't help but shine. Because we're champions. We're swinging on a vine. Laughing our little mouse's ass off. It's never going to get better than this. Boom. Landed the jump. I don't know what to do in this game. All I can do is just shine as a mouse. Living my best life. KJ's living his best life too. Let's get lobster rolls this week. Pasadena. Laugh at our enemies. Take a photo together. Get a hundred likes. Ah, oh, the goddamn mouse died. Game over, dude. We were doing it. Ugh. As we come to the close of another Rapatello Entertainment System, let's play a little Tetris and clear our minds for the Sega Genesis. Tetris is a beautiful game. It's about making blocks. Don't wait on a long block that's not coming. Work with the crooked blocks you have. I just screwed up a block already. God. <clears throat> no, no, we're not going to get mad. That's what our enemies want to do. Want us to do. Get mad. Rage quit. I'm three minutes from ending the stream. Nothing would make them happier. But we're not. We're going to shine. We're on the comeback, baby. Tetris is one of those exciting games that translates well to Twitch. I know everybody's just <laughs> lighting them up right now for this run. Devastating Twitch. Tetris run right now. God, man, we're putting on a show right now. I hope my ex-girlfriends are watching and they're seeing the magic that's being laid down right now. Ugh. Getting there. Lowering our debt. That's what we got to do. We got to lower that debt. All right. Blocks are coming faster, but we just got to stay. Keep our eyes on the game. Don't be distracted. Some of these blocks are shitty. Some of these blocks can help. Oh, look at the ocean behind us now. Focus on the ocean. If you, leer, if you live near the beaches like Manhattan or Ventura, Venice, look at those rocks out there. In 1991, Sega Genesis graphics. Ugh. I'm getting some shitty blocks today, man. Just like in life. I wanted to have a good day and the world's like, no, we're just going to give you a bunch of shitty blocks on Monday. You don't deserve to enjoy yourself. God. Okay, coming down. Ah! And I got the itchy nose. And we're just going to have to call it. We're still champions, though. Remember, Red always will love you. I'll always love you. We'll always be boy cows together. In the sun, in the sun, we will milk him in the sun. He's a boy In the cow, sun, in the sun, we'll milk him in the sun. Gonna go to Orange Julius and get a hot dog.